good morning students today i'm going to explain about family anonaceae which is also called as custard apple family coming to the classification it belongs to the division spermatophyta spermatophyta means seed bearing plants subdivision angiosperm class dicotyledons subclass polypetalae series thalamiflorae order ranales family anonaceae general characters these are large families of 130 genera and 2300 species distributed in tropical part of the world from india more than 25 genera and 200 species have been reported general habit usually aromatic trees are shrubs rarely liana like woody climbers example is species of oxymitra atrabotry is a hook climber bark and leaves and floral part contain oil ducts roots are extensively branched tap roots you can see here in this picture where the root is highly branched next is stem stem is aerial erect or rarely climbing woody branched hard cylindrical and solid leaves are simple alternate you can see it is um, alternate then extipulate petiolate apex acute obtuse or even macronate macronate means sharp point at the apex of the leaf and then uh, ovate obovate or lanceolate lanceolate means a leaf is wider at the base than at the mid point tapers towards the apex and has a length to width ratio of 3 is to 1 or more then um, coriaceous that means having a leathery texture globarous unicostate reticulate gland dotted this is the characteristic features of uh, anonaceae family where you get gland dotted and aromatic leaves are aromatic and gland dotted you have to remember these points inflorescence inflorescence is solitary axillary or terminal or leaf opposed sometimes cauliflowerous that is flower occur on the stem example is polyalthea fragrans so here you can see inflorescence is cauliflowerous that means flower occur on the stem flowers are actinomorphic but zygomorphic in monodora due to difference in the size of petals and uh, hermaphrodite that means bisexual unisexual in stylococarpus complete complete means presence of all the orals trimerous hypogynous that means superior ovary perigynous eupomacia spirocyclic often aromatic calyx sepals 3 sepaloid resembling a sepal in structure and function polysepalous conate at the base here you can see the conate uh, at the base and valvate estivation corolla it consists of uh, six petals uh, two in oral of uh, three each here you can see um, two orals with uh, three petals each valvate or slightly imbricate in estivation 
sometimes no distinction into sepals and petals so perianth is in 3 or more orals of 3 uh, each andrisium stamens numerous spirally arranged on the axis which forms a large convex receptacle filament short and thick anther long extrose tunicate connective bithecus in case of uh, gynecium carpels are numerous or few usually free spirally arranged on the raised uh, receptacle apocarpus apocarpus means having distinct carpels that are not joined together superior unicarpellary unilocular ovules one to many anatropous style short or none stigma small monodora with the syncarpus ovary parietal placentation fruit is an aggregate of berries united to form a single compound fruit example is ananas squamosa seeds are large numerous often embedded in a copious white fleshy pulp uh, this it can be seen in case of ananas squamosa seeds and uh, it is endospermic pollination is through entomophilus due to gaudy and scented flowers now this is the picture of floral diagram here you can see the axis bract and uh, orals of uh, sepals and petals uh, if you see the floral formula in case um, here you can see bracteate or it could be ebracteate actinomorphic bisexual calyx 3 or it could be 3 plus 3 because sepals can be in two orals also with um, in two orals um, with three sepals each and uh, corolla consists of um, petals in two orals with uh, three petals uh, uh, in each orals andrisium infinite gynecium also infinite with superior ovary economic importance of anonesi family uh, some plants like anona squamosa is used as a edible fruit then in timber yielding plants or trees bocagia vergeta and bocagia laurifolia or a timber yielding tree oils the fruit the flowers of desmos chinensis furnish macassara oil a perfume the perfume is also obtained from some other plants also and it is especially liked by arab women fibers the bark of gonio thalamus yt produce strong fiber ornamental atabotry odorati simus and anona disc color are grown in garden for their for their scented flowers desmos sinensis is an ornamental tree at last just to sum up anonesi family i will list out some of the salient features of anonesi Uh, first is wood is aromatic leaves are extipulate floral part usually numerous free spirally arranged stamens are distinctive enlarged flat connective gynecium is multipistillate apocarpus so these are all salient features of anonesi family